Welcome guys to another video. So how can White win in this position? And it looks like an easy win. I mean, all you gotta do is go give a fork and go ahead and win the game. But it's not as easy as that. Because then Black you go King G6. And once you take the Rook, he shows himself in the corner. And now it's a force draw, whatever you do. If you move the Bishop to block the spot for promotion, it's actually a draw by a stalemate. Because the pawn can't move anywhere. But if you think about just moving here instead, he promotes and sacrifices the queen, and it's a draw, anyways. And so, even though giving a fork seems like the right move, it actually isn't. But why actually does king f7? Let me show you why. Now, black obviously want to avoid getting forked, so he goes rook h1. Big blunder. Because then you can go e4, giving a check. Only one move going here, and then bishop f6. One move, and then after g4, it's a checkmate, as you can see. So the best move for black actually wasn't to move all the way down. It was to go h4, and sacrifice the rook, and continue the game being a rook down. He'll probably lose both ways. If you're in these situations, it looks tempting to go for a fork. We'll always look, uh, look for the other, uh, for the next following moves, because then black could show himself into a corner and actually make it a drop. Thank you guys so much for watching and have an amazing day.